Okay, where do I start? Hey YouTube, hey you guys. Welcome to whatever this is gonna be because I'm not doing interviews. I'm on Gravel Street as you can see. Usually during six o'clock in the evening, it's pretty packed with people finishing work and going home or having dinner or whatnot. But we are in the middle of a week three for, I wouldn't say orders, I would say the recommendations to stay at home because of the coronavirus or COVID-19. So I can't do interviews. I can't talk to people unless I have a really long poll, which I don't have and there's not many people to talk to actually so I'm gonna show you what Vancouver's like now. Stores are boarded because there's been an increase in crime. People are trying to break into stores to steal whatever products they can see in the store. recommendation to stay at home came out people didn't really follow it was a sunny day the next day and everybody went to the beach and like crowded so they <laughs> removed the logs from kids beach so the beach is pretty much just sand and they put a log in front of the parking lot entrance so you can't go into that There's signs everywhere to stay apart from each other. Definitely don't want to catch the virus. Take out only, pick up only for restaurants. Stores are closed, nightclubs are closed. Seven o'clock every night for the last, I would say three weeks, there has been celebrations, cheering and pot pan hitting. for the frontline workers. Frontline workers being nurses, doctors, delivery people, people that still work in grocery stores, people that work in restaurants. I filmed just right in front of St. Paul's. But I saw this video my friend posted and it was a doctor from Ontario talking about frontline workers and that they were actually the front lines to this epidemic. It was actually us. It was our responsibility to stay home and stay apart so we don't get infected and make the situation worse than it is. We're the front to this epidemic and nurses and doctors are the last line of defense. If we get infected and we have to go to the hospital, they're the ones that rescue us if we get sick. It's our job to not get sick. We don't have to go into the hospitals. We don't have to use the health care resources. So what I've been doing, I don't know, like home editing videos. I'm actually editing vlogs that I haven't touched for like a year, two years. Yeah, this is totally a different video that I never thought I would ever film. There is bright side to this for sure, but it's bad and we don't want this to happen again. I don't want this to happen. I don't have words to describe what it is pretty much. So hopefully this video can sort of show you what I feel inside. I really hope I can get back to like filming interviews in Vancouver talks and uh, not seeing animals take over. It's kind of nice that animals took over the planet. It's like videos of goats and monkeys taking over anyway anyway okay. i'm just battering on um cut this short who knows thanks for watching share like subscribe m square out